What's going on YouTube? I'm going to show you some of the work I've been working on for the last couple weeks. This is a 3D scanned virtual reality marketplace experiment. And all the items in here are all 3D scanned and brought into um, VR chat, which is a Unity based social virtual reality platform. So you can see all the tables have all been 3D scanned and all have been brought into VR. The size has had to be reduced from roughly a quarter wow, million polygons to um, to about 10,000 polygons each. Now our process for taking these I've demonstrated in another video but what I'm doing is I'm taking a ring of photos about 40, 50 photos in a ring maybe 36 sometimes then I'll move the camera up in height and then I'll take some more photos so I'll take another ring of photos looking down on it normally about four rings total and then I will take them and push them into my photogrammetry software and I'm using a cute 3D but I have demonstrated all the other ones on my YouTube channel and they do work so you can use any of them, Agisoft, Memento, Reality Capture, Acute3D, SFM, all this stuff will work if you know what you're doing. But that's our process for these. And then each one of these items were 3D scanned individually in my light studio. And we took those and we blew them up to gigantic size over there. Like that owl is actually my avatar right now. And that red gauge is this red gauge over here that's been expanded to about 10,000 percent its normal scale. The axe is well, the red I axe. Well, not see like each individual feather on your avatar. Oh, really? It's cool. Yeah. <laughs> um, are you in Skype at the moment? I mean, I what? Are you in the Skype chat? No, I'm not. I still ain't in the Skype group. I need to get in there. I gotta talk to Gunner about it or something. Uh, yeah, you definitely do, because we pretty much chatting there throughout the day. Oh, okay. On um, yeah, various VR chat stuff. Which, yeah, that's how you can see this is like a social virtual reality platform, so I can... So what we're all going to be able to do is buy and sell stuff in this platform and actually have one-on-one -on -one customer engagement, which is going to be just excellent, just like you know the market I grew up in but let's go up and look at this 3d scanned axe you can see it's way bigger than the actual um because yeah, when you're starting a VR chat you can hold control and you can alter the graphic settings oh that's cool it, I didn't know that uh, yeah it's sort of a hidden thing at the moment that this is the red box that's on the table Expanded 10,000%. We're just kind of demonstrating what you can do with 3D scan models in this in this format. You know, that you can make them attractions, or you can you can blow them up just to huge sizes, or even tiny sizes. You can even do like a honey eye shrunk the kids type deal with oh, these species down there. Now, there's not windows in this platform yet, so let me show you what I'm doing to complete the. Uh, the virtual reality market loop. Hello. One second. Wow. So now we're going to show you how we complete the loop. To complete the loop, we're using Sketchfab. Because yeah, at the moment you can't. Because in Sketchfab you have clickable links to everything. So here you can see it. All the items in much better quality. This is near their original quality on everything. And then you can see where they have click through links, nine dollars. Then just normal um e commerce prospects let you complete a uh, virtual reality market loop. Even have abilities to check the price on Amazon and find it. Because yeah, the avatar you've got right now is parts of it are reflective. The future 
Yeah, I'm really happy with it. Like Some of the detail you get in here is just amazing. Um, this room can be found in uh, vrchat.net, uh, and, and the room name is Ion Trades. I have to thank Adam J. Go over to his Twitter page, Adam J. with two A's, to um, find out some of the 3D printing e-commerce stuff he's doing in virtual reality. Some of the stuff he has yeah, is um, with some rooms. he's printing items and selling them in VR, and we'll get him in here shortly as well. But um, thanks for watching YouTube. Um, like and subscribe if you like this kind of stuff.